If you're headed to a holiday gathering, chances are you'll want to bring something to share. Absolutely. Mary Rappaport is back from the Virginia Ag Council to teach us how to make corn pudding. Mary, thank Yum. you so much for being here. First of all, I have to say, uh -huh. when, you are, when you're invited to a Thanksgiving meal, okay. right, and you always say, what can I bring? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Remember the time that I said, what can I bring? And the lady said, bring the turkey. Uh -oh. <laughs> so now I'm Good very point. careful. I'm very careful. I always sort of have something to say. Uh -huh. I have this great corn pudding yeah. recipe. And this is your first Thanksgiving in Virginia. Yeah, uh -huh. So it I've is. kind of prepared some things that you would always oh. have at a Thanksgiving, a Virginia yes, Thanksgiving. Exactly. And corn pudding could mm -hmm. be one of them. Mm -hmm. And it's super easy. Okay. It's so and warm. I'll show you how to do that in a second. Yeah. And then your favorite, yes, green, green, green casserole. casserole. And I was telling you that <laughs> earlier that instead of using cans of okay. cut corn, yeah. I use the kind of, um, uh, of cr I mean, green beans. Uh -huh. I use green beans that you just stick in the microwave oh, in the yes. plastic bag. Okay. And then I just cut them in half and threw them in, and they're really fresher. Okay. And, but still Crunchy. use okay. And gotcha. also yeah. added mm -hmm. some um, some extra mushrooms. Oh, yes. I love extra mushrooms. And then, of course, they ha always have deviled eggs in, in the South, no matter where yes. you have the meal. Mm -hmm. And so instead of doing... Um, a, a lot of work deviled eggs. Yeah. I just bought the the um, the hard boiled eggs that are already done. Okay. Slice them in half and put pimento cheese on top. They look that is very that, southern. Okay. Isn't that, that very cheese southern? is super that southern. Is so I'm finding southern. out. So yes. these are, and then always in the south, you would always have your own specialty uh, cranberry sauce. Yes. yes. So this and then you add the turkey or the ham. Okay. <laughs> Corn pudding. <laughs> Four, Four eggs to start off with. Four eggs. Okay. And then we're gonna put in. Oh, we've got the recipe on the screen there. Yeah, so all okay. the different ingredients. A can of a can of regular corn. This is a small can of um, sweet corn, okay. and then two cans of um, creamed corn. Okay. And you don't have to get the fancy brands mm -hmm. because they're just all going to go in together. They're all, the yeah, all yeah. going to go in mm -hmm. here together, and we kind of move that around there. It's a pretty color. Uh, yeah, it is pretty. And then this is um, some cornstarch. What did it say? Three tablespoons of cornstarch, onions, uh, oh. uh, just um, dried onions, which okay. are really nice to have in your cabinet. Some seasoning, uh -huh. salt, and it could be anything you have that has seasoned right. and salt. Mm -hmm. yeah. And this is dry mustard. Mm -hmm. Mix that all together. Mix this up together. Yes. And you can actually do this ahead of time the day before and mm -hmm. let it sit there. Okay, and this is a fourth of a cup of um, melted butter. Oh. Mm. I, okay. Yeah, that yeah. Mm -hmm. and then a half a cup of milk, any kind of milk you okay. want. Mix it all together. It yes. goes in a greased casserole dish. You grease this, put it in the casserole okay. dish. Okay. 350 degrees. You bake it for an hour, but halfway through, you kind of stir it up. Okay. And oh. I just, I really want you to try this. Yes. <laughs> Go ahead and okay. the best part. part right there. I'm like, can we just These get to the really eating part? Are good. <laughs> yes. It should still be it nice and it. warm. It's a mm. wonderful flavor. Oh it my calls gosh. for sugar, but I didn't add the sugar. I thought the corn was sweet enough. It oh. is. It's perfect. What do you think? Gonna, yeah. yeah it calls for I, a third. But what do you think? Isn't that nice? It's a little different and it's a less sweet. So I love this. Isn't yeah. that a nice flip? And very fresh with the, that mm -hmm. corn mm -hmm. gives it really crunchy flavor. So these would be the sides that you could use not only for Thanksgiving, yes. but all the way through the holidays, whenever you need to bring something. And it's so good. I need mm -hmm. to make this for my first uh, yes. Southern Thanksgiving. Yeah, I know, right? You should, yeah. <laughs> the tip is also get everything done ahead of time and then stick, and then stick in the oven. All, all gotcha. these things can be stuck in the oven the next day or thank something. Thank you, Mary. Okay. We Happy holidays. Yes. yes. Thank you so much. We had her website up on the screen. More mm -hmm. information, Virginia. Yeah. Virginia. Egg, Egg Council.org. Org. There uh -huh. you go.